What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High, Pri High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can uh, smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for sign of Pisces. This will resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter, Mid -Haven or Jupiter charts. So, get the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. Uh, thanks for all the new subscribers. Thanks for all the love and support to your channel. Uh, appreciate you guys. This is the first sign of Pisces. This is for today. If you have Pisces in any aspects of your charts, I encourage everybody to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, at least their Sun, Moon, Rising signs for additional message or messages. This is free general collective reading, so it's very important to only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Um, I received two channel links as I was meditating on your energy, Pisces. The first one, I heard giving respect where respect is due. Finally, that was the first one. So giving respect where respect is due, finally. So that could be somebody giving you respect where, where respect is due, finally. Or you giving somebody else respect where, where respect is due, finally. How that resonates and applies, that was number one. And number two, I heard taxpayer dollars being wasted taxpayer dollars being wasted so somebody's taxpayer dollars are being wasted but we all know that shit and that's just the truth so somewhere somewhere in the universe taxpayer dollars are being wasted but hell that's not a surprise to me i'm sure it's probably not to you guys either that's just the truth so you plug in where it resonates pisces Spirit messages here of Sun Pisces. Target, a goal-oriented person. Pamela, persevere and you will overcome problems. Fair man, dealings or relationship with a man with blonde, gray, or white hair. For some, you can be dealing with a fire sign or an earth sign. Give me one second. I need to shut the door. It's too loud in here. Okay, so sorry about that. For some, you could be dealing with fire sign or earth sign. If you are, they have Aries, Leo, Sag, your course, Capricorn, Virgo, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, and Haven, Jupiter charts. If you are. A Pisces grandparent is about to be forced to come clean about a baby mama and identity, th identity theft. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. A Pisces grandparent is about to be forced to come clean about a baby mama and identity theft. So for some, I feel you could be the Pisces grandparent about to be forced to come clean about a baby mama and identity theft. Or it could be Somebody else. Um, some Pisces grandparent out in the universe. I feel they could be masculine or femme Pisces grandparent and have Pisces in any aspects of their charts. They're about to be forced. It sounds like soon up in the upcoming in the universe. It hasn't happened yet. They're about to be forced to come clean about a baby mama. So I'm presuming their child's mama. I'm not child's mama, but child's um, child's baby mama. Their child's baby mama and identity theft. Um, this Pisces grandparent, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. But some Pisces grandparent out there in the universe, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, their child's baby mama 
is um, I'm presuming they have identity thief, person, people, place, situation. Um, that's what I'm presuming. But if Heisey's grandparent is about to be forced to come clean about a baby mama and identity theft. So, um, for some of these Pisces grandparents, I feel you could have blonde, gray, or white hair. And I feel you could be a feminine, I'm sorry, a masculine with blonde, gray, or white hair. Or a, a masculine, I'm sorry, a femme that takes on heavy masculine. Uh, Pisces grandparent. That's what I'm feeling. You plug in how it resonates. For one, you're bald. For one, you're bald. So for one, you're a Pisces grandparent about to be forced to come clean about a baby mama and a identity theft. You're bald. So for one, you're bald. Uh, you're bald. And for one, I feel you have blonde, gray, or white hair. And I feel you can either be a masculine or a femme that takes on heavy masculine. Creation. Lizard. For one, you were really hoping a fire sign would fail. Really hoping they would fail. But they have ra risen in a huge way and they will continue to rise. Low vibrational Pisces. It's about to backfire on you in a huge way. Oh, Lord. Okay, so for one, you're a low vibrational Pisces. You don't treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. You have to plug yourself in where you fit if you do. Um, only you know your story, your situation, not anybody else. But whoever that's for, it's a low vibrational Pisces. I heard they were really hoping a fire sign would fail, but I heard they have not failed. They have not failed. It's an Aries Leo Sag. Fire sign Femme. Fire sign Femme. It's Fire sign Femme, Aries Leo Sag Femme. They have not failed, and I heard they have actually risen so like a phoenix rising from the ashes um energy is exactly what i'm feeling here and i feel this fire sign i heard they've already rose and they will continue to rise so i feel they uh they're a good shape shifter with the lizard in, lizard energy they're a good shape i can't speak <laughs> they're a good shape shifter and they know how to intermingle with people and converse with people and they know how to feel the energy and to navigate through energy, whether it's positive or negative. A very good manifester and good shifter of energy. This person leaves you shook. Oh, my Lord. I heard they're a very good uh, shape shifter, a very good manifester, and a very good um, um, maneuverer through energy. And I heard this person leaves you shook. So if this resonates for you, you're a low vibrational low Pisces. You don't treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. And this fire sign fan leaves you shook because they're a good, manip uh, not manipulator, but maneuver through energy. And they know how to feel energy, decipher energy, maneuver through it, whether it's positive or negative. They're a good shapeshifter. And they know how to converse with people. Um interact with people and be appropriate in situations space basically um so they're a good they, they they know how to manipulate the not manipulate but um maneuver through the world they know how to maneuver through the world i heard they leave you shook um but you're a low vibrational pisces because anybody that wishes anybody doesn't do well in the world you're low you're low vibrational that's just the truth you should wish Positive upon everybody, and that's just the truth, whoever you are. And I feel whoever you are, you possibly might have blonde, gray, or white hair, or the bald person um, I was picking up in there earlier. You plug it in how it resonates. A Pisces tarot card reader is about to get a shocking phone call from an investigator soon. It's about to shock the hell out of you. It's about a fire sign feminine, and you know who this fire sign fem is. Okay, Pisces tarot card reader is about to get a shocking phone call from an investigator soon. 
Um, I heard it's going to, sh the phone call is going to shock the hell out of you. You're a Pisces tarot card reader. I feel like you can be masculine or feminine Pisces tarot card reader and have Pisces in any aspects of your charts. But whoever you are, you're about to get a shocking phone call from an investigator. So I feel that could be a public or private investigator or a police investigator or a fed. However, that resonates and applies some kind of investigative energy. They're about to call you, it sounds like Pisces, masculine and feminine Pisces tarot card reader. And I heard it's going to shock you. So it's going to be shocking. They're, you're about to get this phone call, but it sounds like you're about to from this investigator. And I heard it's regarding a fire sign femme. So your fire sign, fire sign femme energy here. And I heard you know who this fire sign femme energy is. Um, whoever this Aries Leo Sage femme energy is to you. Uh, Pisces tarot card reader. Okay. For some, I feel you possibly could have blonde, gray, or white hair. Possibly. Melanated skin is very significant. Melanated skin is very significant is what I heard. Pisces tarot card reader. Okay, so for you, Pisces tarot card reader, melanated skin is very significant. So melanated skin is dark or darkish type complexion of skin. Lots of melanin in it. In it. So I feel you could be melanated skin. So darker complexion, Pisces. Or the fire sign femme, the investigator is contacting you about, could have melanated skin. How that resonates and applies, or both. How that resonates and applies, okay? Elk. A boss is about to become very significant in a Pisces life in a 3D workspace. Way, way more in your life than you thought they would be. Work life. Okay, a boss is, uh, okay, so a boss in your 3D workspace, if this resonates and applies for you, Pisces, they're about to become way more significant in your 3D work life than you thought they would be. So, um, they're, about to be way more in your life than you thought they would be, but it sounds like in your work life, so um, maybe you like to work independently, or you thought you'd be working independently, or you have been working independently, but somehow your boss is about to become very, like, more in your life, in your 3D workspace life, whether you want them to be there or you don't, how that resonates and applies. Um, for some, I feel this might could be micromanaging, possibly. Maybe they're going to micromanage you or attempt to micromanage you or they are micromanaging you. How that resonates and applies. But in this aspect, this is your boss. The elk antlers indicate leadership. So they are over you in a leadership position above you. So whether you want them to be there or you don't. For some, I feel they could have blonde, gray, or white hair and be a masculine energy or a femme that takes on heavy masculine. How that resonates and applies. Pisces. But if this resonates for you, you work in a 3D workspace and your boss is about to get very heavily involved with you, whether you want them to be or you don't. A Pisces child that works at the same corporate conglomerate that you do, medical corporate conglomerate, they're about to get terminated through many shocking series of chain events. They're very lazy. They talk back a lot. Somebody's about to not be dealing with this bullshit. It's about to piss you off in a huge way. You are a position of high authority at this facility. Oh, my Lord. Okay, so whoever you are, Pisces, you're a position of authority in a medical corporate conglomerate facility. But your child works in the same facility you do. Um, and you probably got them hired on. And I'm just being for real. Um, I know how the real world works, and that's just the truth. You probably got, I don't care what you're clicking on the application. You probably got them hired on. But I heard... Um, they're about to get terminated soon. It's about to shock you and it's about to piss you off. I heard they're lazy. They talk back. 
and somebody's about to get tired of the shit and they're about to terminate it. This child is 25 and below. And they're going to have a very hard time finding you another job. Someone needs to hear this. Oh, my Lord, I heard this child is 25 or below. So, Pisces, you can be masculine in Pisces. I feel you're older. Um, it's an adult child, um, I'm feeling. I heard they're 25 or below. Um, or for some, it could be a teenager. But they're 25 or below, definitely. Your position of authority in a medical corporate conglomerate. But I feel you got them hired on. And I'm just being for real. You stretch your connections to get your child, child hired on. I don't care what you clicked on the application, and that's just damn true. But they're lazy, they talk back, and somebody is about to get tired of this shit. So you're not their boss, it's somebody else is their boss. Um, I heard it's going to piss you off. But I heard they're going to, once they get terminated from the same place you work at, same facility, because um, you're a position of authority too. You wear the uh, antler, antler, antler too, just saying, just saying. But I don't feel you're their boss, somebody else is. Um, I heard it's gonna, they're going to find a very, have a very hard time finding another job in another, um, place. I'm assuming in your area and vicinity is what I'm presuming. If they find another one, they probably won't. If they find another one, they probably won't. Okay. I heard if they find another job, they probably won't. So you plug in how it resonates Pisces. I feel you're probably... I'm feeling probably 40 or above. You either have a teenager that works there or you have somebody adult that's 25 or below. So I'm feeling you're probably 40 or above. And I feel you could possibly have blonde, gray, or white hair and be a masculine or a femme that takes on heavy masculine. How that resonates and applies. And a Pisces is about to get a new boss. Much younger than you. But they're very good at their job. You're not going to want to accept this person in. But there's going to be no choice. And a Pisces is about to get a new uh, new boss. I heard they're about to be much younger than you. You're not going to want to accept this person in. So accept this person into your workspace. And them as a leader to you in a workspace dynamic, I'm presuming, Pisces. But I heard you're, you're going to have to, whether you want to or not. Um, it, they're about to be boss and leader over you. So antler, uh, antlers over you. Leadership over you. Um, they are much younger than you. Um, it's a very nice looking masculine energy. It's a very nice looking masculine energy, if this resonates for you. So they're very nice looking masculine energy. Um, they're about to become your boss, but you're not going to want to accept them in and respect them as a leader. But I heard they're very good, very good at their job, so they know what the hell they're doing. But I think the problem here is ages, ageism, because you're about you're uh, much older than this person is. He's young. Um, I'm feeling he's probably 35, 34 or below. I didn't hear age on him, but I'm feeling he's probably 35, 34 or below. He might have blonde, gray, or white hair, possibly. He's definitely a masculine energy. He hasn't become your boss yet, but he's about to be. I heard your new job, new boss. Target, a goal-oriented person. A property lawyer is about to get heavily involved in the stolen inheritance. For one, you're a lawyer and you're about to be very mortified about this because your client helped, helped steal it. Oh, my Lord. Okay, so a uh, property lawyer is about to get involved in a stolen inheritance, I heard. Um... If this resonates for you, but I heard you're a lawyer. If this resonates for you, you're a lawyer and you're about to be very heavily embarrassed because I heard 
one of your clients help steal the in a stolen inheritance. So if this resonates for you, you're a Pisces lawyer, but you're about to be very embarrassed because it sounds like you're about to hear about this. Some kind of property lawyer is about to get involved involving stolen inheritance, but one of your clients or former clients, how that resonates and applies Pisces lawyer, help steal the inheritance. That's, I mean, that's why you got to choose your clientele and your business very carefully. And that's just the truth. I feel you could possibly have blonde, gray, or white hair. You might be a masculine or a fin that takes on heavy masculine. You pl plug it in how it resonates. Oh, man. A goal-oriented person. For one, you do YouTube, you're a YouTuber, and you're about to hit a desired subscriber amount. It's about to make you very happy. Well, congratulations to whoever you are. Okay. So, for one, you're a YouTuber, and you're about to hit des uh, desi desired um, subscriber amount, and it's about to make you very happy. So, you're a goal-oriented goal goal person as far as getting to a certain amount of subscribers is what I'm feeling here. I didn't hear what you do on YouTube, but that would make sense with the creation card. You're a YouTube creator. You're a YouTube content creator. And um, you're about to hit a desired amount of subscribers. Um, you want it, it sounds like you've been wanting to hit this goal on the subscriber mark on your YouTube, and you're about to do it. You possibly could have blonde, gray, or white hair and be masculine or a fin that takes on heavy masculine. You plug it in how it resonates um, or not. But you are definitely a content creator, and you're about to hit a certain amount of subscribers. Congratulations to whoever that's for. For one, your goal and dream is to marry a Virgo. And through many series of shame events, you're about to run away with this person. A different location, different area, and you're going to run away and get married. You're a Pisces fam. Okay, Pisces fam. So for one, you're a Pisces fam, and your goal, your goal-oriented person, your goal here is to marry a Virgo masculine. I heard a Virgo masculine. And I heard through many series of chain of events, you're about to make it happen. You're about to create your dreams here and run away with him. I heard to a, a far distance location than what you're at. So it sounds like y'all are about to elope. You're about to run away, move away, and elope and get married. Um, so you're about to hit your goal and marry this Virgo masculine and move very far away. It sounds like from everybody you know. Um, creation, that's the marriage right there. However, that resonates and applies. You're about to persevere and overcome your uh, goal, um, your problems. I think people in your community doesn't want you to get married to this Virgo masculine Pisces fam. And I think you know this. And that's why you're about to run away um, with him. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, your Virgo masculine possibly could have blonde, gray, or white hair. Or you could have blonde, gray, or white hair. How that resonates and applies, um, Pisces. You're a Pisces fan. Camel, persevere, and you will overcome problems. Through many series of chain of events, a Pisces fam is about to become a widow. Shocking death of a spouse. It is about to overwhelm you in a huge way. They're about to pass away in such an unexpected way. It's about to shock the hell out of you. Oh my God, I'm so sorry for whoever that's for. I'm so sorry. Holy crap a moly. Okay, so for one, you're a Pisces fam. You're legally married and... Through many series of chain events, you're about to become a widow, um, ma'am. Um, my condolences. I, that's terrible. I heard he's about to pass away in a very shocking, unexpected way. Um, and I heard it's about to stress you out and overwhelm you when he passes away. Um, 
I feel for some you might have kids. For some you might not, but I feel for some you do. Um, I didn't hear you did, but I, I intuitively feel you might. But he's about to pass away in a very unexpected way. So a way, it, it doesn't sound like anybody's expecting him to pass away. Um, on the job, workplace injury. Death. On the job, workplace injury, death. My God Almighty. What, I, he must do something dangerous. Whatever the hell it is. On the job, workplace injury, and it sounds like it's going to result in a death. I hope you get some good insurance money off that shit, and that, that's just the truth. Damn. Um, this is terrible. My condolences for whoever this is for, but I heard it's going to stress you out. You're about to become a widow soon. Uh, it's some kind of on-the-job injury that's going to result in a death. Persevere and you overcome problems. You're about to become a widow. Hopefully a rich widow. I didn't hear you were going to become a rich widow, but I sure hope so. Just saying, just saying. Um, for some, your spouse could have blonde, gray, or white hair, or you could have blonde, gray, or white hair, possibly. Fair man dealing with a relationship with a blonde, gray, or um, blonde, with a man with blonde, gray, or white hair. A very significant insurance payout and workers' compensation is about to become very significant in Pisces' life. A very significant um, insurance payout and workers' compensation is about to become very significant in Pisces' life. So for some of you guys, I feel you could get workers' compensation possibly, or somebody you're connected to could get workers' compensation, or you're about to go to the court of law and fight for workers' compensation, how that resonates and applies. And then um, a, a very large insurance payout is about to become very significant, whether you are about to receive this large insurance payout or somebody else is. Um, I feel you possibly could have blonde, gray, or white hair or somebody you're dealing with in this workers' compensation situation or large insurance payout situation could have blonde, gray, or white hair. You or um, somebody you're connected to could be a masculine or a pen that takes on heavy masculine. You plug it in how it resonates, Pisces. For one, you're about to downsize to a much smaller home through many series of shame events. For one, you're about to downsize to a much smaller home through many series of shame events. So you plug it in how it resonates. For one, you're about to downsize to a much smaller home through many series of shame events. So you plug in how it resonates. Creation. Content creator strong. For one, your family member, you're about to find out they're pregnant again. It's about to frustrate the hell out of you. They pop out children like crazy. Holy moly almighty. Oh my God, Pisces. Okay, so for one, you're I heard content creator strong. So for one, you're a content creator. Um, so congratulations, I am too, just saying, just saying. And for one, I heard you're about to find out your family member is pregnant again. I heard they pop out babies like crazy. So I don't know. Um, only you know your situation story, not anybody else. Only you know if you've got a family member that sounds like every time you turn around, they're fertile myrtle and they're popping out kids like left and right. I heard it's going to frustrate you. So... It sounds like they have many kids or they don't take care of the kids that they have. And it sounds like many of them have that resonates and applies. But one of you guys has a family member that sounds like pops out kids left and right. And there's a, it's a reason it frustrates you. So I think they don't take care of the kids that they have. Or you have custody of their kids or something of that nature. But there's a reason them popping out all these babies frustrates you. But I think it's because you take care of your, their kids or help take care of them. How that resonates and applies. Content creator strong and in this aspect creation is creation of another life. 
how that resonates and applies to Pisces. Grad school is significant for one. And a trip to Morocco. Oh, man, I want to go to Morocco. Holy shit. So grad school, so graduate school. So one of you guys, I feel you're in graduate school or you're about to be accepted to graduate school or somebody you're connected to is in graduate school or is about to be accepted to graduate school. Grad school energy. How that resonates applies. Congratulations. You're saying to saying. And for one, um, a trip to Morocco is significant soon. So this could be you about to take a trip to Morocco or somebody you're connected to. All right. I love you guys so much. Namaste.